Hey, what's going on, guys? Guys. Hey there, what's up? This is AJ170, and today I will be showing <clears throat> you how to play Game Boy and Game Boy Color games. Game Boy Advanced games will not work, so please do not try. You need three required apps. You have to have them. The first one is the emulator itself called Game Play. It does work offline. It may or may not lag. With me, it lags just a little tiny, tiny bit. The sound quality may also be messed up. You do need Zip Extractor because it does not have a uh, built-in extractor. And you do need a Google Drive account along with the app downloaded to the device you are downloading all this to. I'll be showing you how to install ROMs and how to install the app. So step one, go to the link in the description. Sorry, wrong tab. Right here, it tells you what to do. Open in your mobile Safari or on your iPhone or iPad, whatever, iPod. Tap the share button, which is this thing right here. That icon that the thing just went over. You tap that. And you hit add to home screen and then just save it all. I'm going to copy this link real quick. Now, once it is opened, it will go and it will ask you to set all this stuff up. First things first, download Zip Extractor because you will need this, I guarantee it. And then the second thing is, is go create a Google Drive account and download the app, of course. It does not work with Dropbox. Keep it inside of the main files, like how it's not inside of one of my folders, how it's like right inside that right here under the main tab. You're going to leave it there. So now you're going to go to a site of your choice, which I will leave uh, my favorite one in the description. This is my favorite one, is the Emulator Paradise. Now if you go to the direct link like this, or if you have a different one, you're going to hit View All Sections. Thought it was Game Boy Color what happened to those. I know I said I know for a fact there's Game Boy Color games. Hold on, let me find these. Cause Game Boy Advance ROMs like you see right there will not work. Oh here it is, here it is, sorry. It was a different color. So only Game Boy Color and Game Boy ROMs will work. Game Boy Advance ROMs, anything in there will not work. So I'm just gonna go into the color ones. Now by downloading these, you sign a waiver pretty much by downloading it that you own a hard copy. If you do not own a hard copy, it becomes pirating, and then that's when it becomes illegal. The games I'm currently downloading, I do own hard copies of, don't have a heart attack. So let's just download, well let's download Mario, Mario's awesome. Scroll down, wait for the page to load, scroll down even more even more even more and right here where it says download links direct not where the pictures are you're actually going to click that now we have to wait for it to load more scroll down as you see it's preparing and then you'll see the direct download link again you're going to click that and you'll see it starts in 13 seconds This does work offline once you install it and play the game at least once. It will work offline. As you can see, it already went to there. Now, once you do that, you're going to tap Open In. Now, whatever your zip extractor is, open it in there. As you can see right here, I don't, I don't, it's in a zip format, so I'm going to hit Open in Zip Extractor. I'll leave a link in the description for the zip extractor URL. Now, you right here, you're going to tap Extract. And you're going to see Super Mario Bros. You're going to click that. 
I'm going to click the little I. And then as you can see how it says .gbc, it has to be a .gbc or a .gb format. You're going to select Open In. You're going to select Open in Google Drive. I'm going to collect Upload. I just realized I forgot to play my music. It's too late now. You do need a count to do the Google Drive part. I'm going to scroll down. As you can see, Super Mario Bros. Deluxe is right there. Close out. We're going to go into Gameplay. going to say it's loading. At least the first time you open up the ROM, it has to be connected to the internet, and then after that you can just double tap the home button, slide out, put it into airplane mode, and you can play it offline. It's already playing this one. I wanted to play a different one. The other one's not showing up, so that means that it is... Oh, here it is right here. It had load. Sorry, I thought it wasn't supported. So let's select Super Mario Bros. See if this lags at all. Oh, look at that! It changed colors. I know I did that. So it'll take a while to load the first time since it's extracting it from your Google Drive and saving it to the app or web page, whatever. As you can probably already hear that the sound is kind of glitchy. And I am currently recording, so it's going to be even slower than normal. This reminds me of the Nintendo DS emulator on my on my iPad. Super lag. I will try and find a better one that does work offline also that does not lag. But as you see it does work probably on newer devices like an iPhone 5 it'll work a lot better. If it wasn't lagging, you'd be able to see that's working, but I'm currently recording. As you can see, the thing went down. But like I said, I'm recording, so it's going to be even slower. So that's how you do it. This is AJ170 signing out. Please hit that like button. Please subscribe. Please comment. Please share. Wizard,